You can catch Daily Blast Live right here on ABC 10 every weekday at 11.30 a.m. discussing the latest hot topics and trends. Today, we've got Al Jackson and Lindsey Granger, and we're talking about ex-boyfriends and ex-girlfriends. Hey, Al and Lindsey. <laughs> hey, Aubrey, how's on? it going? Lindsey, I know this is near and dear to your heart. How do is you... <laughs> How do you, because I, I mean, how do you feel about this? Because I, I, I'm very curious. I think I know. Um, I feel like it, in the beginning, I never really love an ex person. Like, you know, we break up. I kind of, and then when I get over it, yeah, I think that they're a great person. You grow from those relationships. It's important to stretch before you grow, right? That, so I think that I learned something from some of those things. See, some people are left with less peace. Some people more peace. And th this is why I said that. I just feel like Lindsay is such a professional. I feel like <laughs> you handle your relationships in the same way. I feel like you break up with dudes in a conference room. Just, <laughs> just like I, re really nice and just like this is over. Like you don't have any ill line. will. He knows he's not getting his car keyed, but he also knows there's not going to be any follow. Like when it's over with Lindsey Granger. It's over. Is that correct? Oh, I sent it the two breakups ago. I sent a long email and said, "Call me after you're done reading this, so I could detail each thing <laughs> oh that I wanted to say and get crystal clear, and then we could discuss." Because I get flustered sometimes. So instead of that, I'm like, "Read this email," which was like, "I'll take it up your whole screen." I feel like your Let's email discuss. had links in it for him to click on. <laughs> like, <laughs> here's so how you he download Tinder. Doesn't agree <laughs> with this. He probably uh, doesn't like me very much. I don't know. I, well, I think it's a little different for men just just because we grow up much later in life than you guys do. So I, I think like men, we, we can reflect back on relationships and be like, that was totally on me. That was that was my fault. You trying uh, to say that women never take the blame? I think that you guys are a lot more uh, emotionally mature earlier. So I think that kind of who you are in your early relationships is a better indicator of who you're going to be as an adult. Whereas I feel like most guys are inside roughly about 17 years old until they're 40. Yeah. It goes and from it, 17 to yeah, 40. Guys, yeah, between 17 and 23. Yeah. That's insane. I go, yeah, do you hear any arguments so, in this room? So like, you say that you have peace with any ex that you had in your life. You're like, oh, that's a lot awesome. Of they're great, yeah, great I, women. I have peace with them. They, <laughs> I, they don't love you. <laughs> I think there might be some people with some uh, some grudges. Oh, my yeah, gosh. Yeah, I think there might be some grudges there, but that's all right. You know, well, you live and you learn. Well, this is one interesting topic that we're talking about, but we also, you know, today, and it's um, to change the tone a little bit, we have um, John Castillo, who's the father of Kendrick Castillo, who was killed in the school shooting. He's coming to talk to the panel. As a father, you're going to get to sit down with him. Yes. Um, what are some things that are on your mind as you see that interview about to come up today? It was, uh, you know, in full disclosure, you know, was the, uh, you know, I get up early on Thursdays to do a, a radio show and usually I get up and I think about what I'm doing on the radio show I literally opened my eyes this morning Aubrey and this was it was the first thing that I thought about I mean I it, it's every parents beyond nightmare I mean this is you know so just but the advocacy and the way that the strength that he and his wife has d d displayed I can't wait to talk to him and just thank him for what he's done and hope we can get him through this so you guys have to stay tuned we have a great show coming up all right Al and Lindsay it's always great to chat with you guys thanks for being with us today this interview involves commercial content. The products and services featured appear as paid advertising.